What's up everyone? How's it going? Let me switch this over before I forget again. Spawning in the southwest of Gorge, we have Roger Scruton as our yellow, yellow Delhi Sultanate. Up here in the northwest, we have Real Starflark as our blue Jean Dark. See if we're gonna... Uh, we'll have to wait and see if there's any early aggression coming out of our Dally Sultanate player. If he's going to just try to play for contr uh, map control. If he's going to go for eco. Well, eco damage. There's a lot of possibilities that our Dally could do. One of them isn't Fast Castle. But I wouldn't be too surprised either. Because you kind of have to throw sideballs, sidewinders at the Jean d'Arc player keep them on their toes because if you play the game that they want to play nine times out of ten you're gonna get wrecked Me? so what I generally do is play pretty defensively and try to go into a fast castle get a tech advantage and try to push from there try not to feed the Jean d'Arc at all in the early stages you do not want her hitting level three while you're still in feudal if she hits level three in castle that's okay you just don't want to deal with the level three jean d'arc in feudal she has way too much ammo ammo uh not even ammo wow too much armor to deal with five base melee five base ranged plus the 50 percent range reduction damage reduction as well so your counters aren't counters anymore unless you get about 20 spears stabbing her at the same time yeah it's better if you just don't engage her in feudal don't feed her and hopefully you'll be able to take the win in castle age already have upgrades coming through of course from the mosque single scholar nothing to Impressive there. One moment. Okay, I am back. Sorry about that. I had to clear my throat. <clears> throat> okay, where was I? I don't remember where I left my where I was on my train of thought school of cavalry coming down and now the house oh no tower of victory okay so with the tower of victory that would be a little bit more map controly but the school of cavalry is already almost halfway done the age of four our dally players pretty delayed in comparison it is two villagers while well, Jean d'Arc and another villager getting that up so it'll be done fairly quickly and then we should be seeing quite a few uh spears coming out for roger as well i couldn't imagine that he would be going the normal gauzy gauzy raider archer type style here yeah the gauzy raiders do a little bit bonus damage they do additional plus two no yeah, plus two to armored units, but that's not going to be enough to deal with the uh, with the Royal Knights. Sorry, my dogs are like barking in the background. If you can hear them. Yeah, I just heard them like when I was in mid sentence right there. So I was trying to like figure out what they're barking at. If I hear the door opening. But I think they're just, you know, being dogs <laughs> and barking at the wind. Immediately get Royal Knight queued up. Yeah, so far this just looks like a pretty standard game out of our Jean Dark player. There's nothing special whatsoever. It's going to be the same exact thing as our uh, French original as well the major difference being is of course Jean d'Arc she is very tanky very strong extremely good 
she has yet to hit level three. Oops, wrong one. I forgot I'm supposed to be lowering the volume for my headset. We are getting the scout, going around, trying to kill a couple of the wolves. And a charge coming up. It's gonna connect onto the... No, nice reaction time. It's still gonna connect though. Ooh, nice little body block right there. Completely just cancels out the charge. I've been seeing that more and more recently. These people, these freaking like top 200 players have been getting a lot better. They really have. And here goes Jean Dark against the boar. Stab, stab, slash. What is it? Plus 12, right? To plus 10 to huntable animals. And of course, I forgot to switch over my observer keys again. Oopsie. <clears throat> if it isn't one thing, it's another, I swear. What kind of production do we have in the back of this? Just one stable right now. Surprised that we haven't seen a barracks yet. There it goes. So we're going to be sitting on a 111, one barracks, one archery range, one stables. Two Gauzy Raiders are out so far for Roger. Starflark sitting on two Royal Knights, third one in queue. Jean Dark herself and an archer will be popping out pretty. Oh, the archer just popped up. And now, five villagers. This is what you're gonna want to do as the as Jean Dark. Just send out five villagers. You don't need to send out the full eight in order to start nom nom in the boar. Because with these five, you're gonna drop your outpost and what's going to end up happening is if you get raided and you have eight five of them are going to be safe and you're going to lose three villagers so unless you're the russ where your wooden fortress holds all eight of them just send out five i've been making this mistake every so often as well because i'll i don't go for the boar as quickly little attack right here Archers, Spears, Gauzy Raiders, doing a decent amount of damage onto... Ooh, are they going to be able to get a... No, they're not going to be able to get a Royal Knight. That would have been really good for uh, Roger if he was able to pick one off. Nice little reverse charge right there. I'm pretty sure that Royal Knight's going to go down. Yes, it is. And the second one should live, though. He's still at about half health as long as he just beelines it straight back home. Never mind. He decides to attack. Yeah, he just needs to go home. You can't be over here. He's gonna go down. Yeah. Yeah, there he goes. He's dead. And Starflark just loses two Royal Knights right there for free. No real damage was done. He didn't get a single military unit. He didn't get any uh, villagers with it. And now Jean Dark is all by her lonesome. She is definitely gonna be going down to these Gauzy Raiders not going to be able to get a single kill either divine restoration does come through it's not going to be enough holy wrath as well charge comes through but she still goes down regardless that was a little careless from our jean d'arc player leaving her out in the open like that without any reinforcements and so many gauzy raiders on the field as well Starflark is sitting on seven archers, three royal knights, but Roger's on six, uh, six archers of his own, four spears, six gauzy raiders. His army is just so much bigger. I'm not entirely sure why he's backing off from this. He could just jump on this and potentially end the game off of the back of this one victory right here because the losses for, uh, for Starflark are going to be so significant in comparison. He could have potentially microed back the Gauzy Raider right there, the uh, the weakened one, kept that alive a little longer, decided against it, or just wasn't paying attention, either or. Maybe he didn't like him. He didn't like that specific Gauzy Raider. Gonna potentially lose another Royal Knight. Charge goes off. Gauzy for Royal Knight. I'll take that trade. That's completely fine. And now we're sitting on 21 military for uh 
for our Delhi Sultanate player. He's trying to rush up some outposts, but this could be a little too late for him. The Gazi Raiders are going to do bonus damage to Jean Dark. She's still going to be dishing out a significant amount of damage, though. Does back off. Nice little micro from her. The outpost might be able to come up, but in the process, loses three villagers, four villagers now? The defensive position for our Jean d'Arc player is up there. She is, or he is going to be able to hold this now. And for some reason, decides to just donate so many, uh, so many archers to Jean d'Arc. Straight up just feeding her at this point. He was sitting at 22 military supply, drops down to nine. Now has four archers, three spears, and that's it. He did move out onto the map, starts getting the sacred sites for the gold trickle. But he just fed the crap out of Jean d'Arc. She should be pretty close at this point. She should be pretty close at this point to getting level three. Once that level three happens, okay, I really hate doing this, guys. But I'm gonna have to switch over to the other UI. Where are you? Uh, 355 out of 500. So pretty close. Just another 145 experience to go before she hits level three. That's only one more major battle, depending if she's able to get picked off or not. Roger sitting on 37 villagers, 15 military, five spears, eight archers, one Gauzy Raider with three queued up. Is it all off of one stable though? Yeah, it's all off of one stable. So that's going to be a slow trickle of units coming through. As for Starflark, he's sitting on 15 archers, four, five Royal Knights now, and 35 military, I mean, uh, 35 villagers. Roger has been able to kill off four workers total, as where Starflark hasn't gotten a single one. Gauzy Raider is going to be going off. A few Gauzy Raiders are going to be able to go off. Do they get scouted, though? I think they did. No, actually, I don't think they did. I really don't. And now we are going to be getting another little mini skirmish over here. Wrong way. Let's see if he's going to commit to this. Starflark does have a decent, uh, decent archer count. But remember, these are Tower of Victory archers for Roger. So they do have that increased attack speed. He will be able to have or he will have higher DPS than his French counterparts. So it's. Wait, where did the where did the Gazi Raiders go? I saw them rotating up here towards the towards the east. Did they really get picked off? Ooh, he's gonna find these villagers right here on the southern side of the map at the berries. Picks off two. He's gonna be able to get quite a few though. This is one of those cases that I was talking about. Makes an outpost. Five will survive and all the other ones will die. And I was as I was mentioning before, I'm I've been making this mistake more and more recently. I have no idea why of sending 12, 15 villagers to the deer and only having one outpost. Then it gets raided and I lose everything. Nice little charge right here. Does get a ton of damage onto two of those Gauzy Raiders. Jean d'Arc herself is here as well in order to try to soak up as much experience as she can. Does not happen. No experience given. Looks pretty cool, though. Yeah, I don't know why I've been doing that. It's costed me so many games recently. Sending the eight villagers to the boar, only one outpost. So then when it gets raided, I lose three villagers and it's incremental. It's two here, two here, and then I look at the replay at the end of the game. I've lost like 30 something villagers because I just keep making these incremental mistakes and I'm not trading. Well, my my fights are cost effective. I'm trading extremely well during fights, but I'm not being I'm not doing any real eco damage behind it while they are. And it, like I said, it's not major eco damage. It's two villagers here, three villagers here, one villager there. Oh, is he going to go in? That would have been a really good time to charge into that. It does get canceled. 
There's 26. So we have 62 military for Roger, 26 archers, 21 spears, 12 Gauzy Raiders. Starflark sitting on 40, 45 military. 31 archers, 14 Royal Knights. Jean d'Arc, who's still level two. She should be hitting level three fairly soon. So Roger is going to have to try to commit to this eventually without losing too much. But as I say that, he loses so many spears right there for free. And now we're going to get level three pops, but she's stuck. She's stuck in between the two armies and she gets picked off before too many units for Roger die. She's going to lose out on a ton of experience right there, but she is level three now. Her champions are out on the field, just killing the poor little spearmen, the Delhi spearmen, little by little. And now the Royal Knights get into the back line and they're just going to completely decimate the archers for Roger. Look at them. Look at the poor little archers. They're just going to get wrecked. There's a lot of weakened uh, Royal Knights here. So the Spears and the Ghazi that come in from the back are going to be able to deal with this. But still, that was a lot of archers that went down right there because the front line just got obliterated by our... Or um, the front line for our Dali Sultanate player did just get obliterated. There is a potential counterattack over here on the northern side. Able to kill off five more villagers. Currently sitting at nine, uh, Roger is currently sitting at, at nine villager kills to the four of Starflark. And now we're going to be getting a wall straight down the middle of the gorge. Ton of villagers over here on, on the eastern side of the map. How many do we have right here? 26 villagers, 27 villagers over here on the eastern side of the map. If that gets scouted out, that could be pretty devastating for our Jean d'Arc player, but we are getting walls thrown up now. I'm, yeah, I'm 99% sure this is going to be a single villager right here. I'd love to see these four villagers just start helping. Wait, when did I swap that over? Oh, yeah. Okay. I forgot the when I switched over to the classic view or whatever it's called. Regular UI. It messed with my... Uh, caster UI. My bad, guys. I didn't realize that soon enough. Wait, Gazi Raiders are over here. All of those villagers did get moved. One poor little... One poor little villagers. Villager is going to have to make all of those. Can the Gazi Raiders win this? I'm not entirely sure. I don't think they could have. Maybe? No, I don't think so. I don't think the Gazi Raiders. That's a lot of Gazi Raiders, though. How many is that? 11. Let's say three of them die pretty quickly. So eight. How much damage do the Gazis do? They do 15 damage to her because she's armored. We are getting a charge. And is he paying attention, though? Yes, he is. Okay, his spears were in the process of bracing. He's going to try to cut it off. I'm not entirely sure what those Gazi Raiders were doing right there. But that could have ended a lot worse than what it did. Three charges left on the Holy Wrath. That was a nice Holy Wrath right there. It did get a huge chunk of the uh, of the spear ball that was going on there. Wait, are these done yet? Okay, the walls on the western side are completely finished. A little bit of a breach down the middle. Gazi Raiders are going to be moving over yet again to the eastern side because they know there's going to be a lot of villagers there. But what is he going to... How is he going to do it? Is he just going to wrap around or is he going to try to... Oh, another potential fight right here in the middle of the map. Roger does hit Castle Age behind this. He went with Compound of the Defender. 32 archers for our Jean d'Arc. French variant. 40. 40 archers. Tower of Victory archers for Roger. 
A few more villagers are going down in the back. He was able to pick off four more that were at the deer. Three Royal Knights are chasing down these Gazi Raiders. We need to see all the veterans he's coming through. They are free. They just take time. And I don't believe he has enough scholars in the back. Where, where are his... Where are your scholars? He has six of them. I think all six are inside of the military buildings, though. So these veterancy upgrades are going to be very, 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 very late. Insanely late. Like, this is not good at all. The upgrades are going to be taking forever. He needs to move these scholars over. He desperately needs to move these scholars over to his mosque to crank these out fast because what are we looking at five minutes three minutes yeah veteran sees done in a minute 20 kidney oh wait which one's this veteran see oh yeah for the gauzy raider it kind of looks similar to the spearman veteran see what's getting crossbows not sure if i actually like the crossbow transition here it will help deal with the oh you know just count attack what are you doing roger send your own archers against his archers yours are way better their tower of victory archers charge is going to be coming through from those royal knights onto the military of our delhi Sultanate. that is a huge clump of units though that is an absolutely massive clump of units. We have men at arms out. John Dark is trying to figure out a way to get into the middle of that army in order to holy wrath, but I don't think it's gonna really matter. The clump is almost gone. 35 damage and 1.25 tile radius right there from John Dark. She's almost dead. She does go down, but the majority of our Gazi or of our Delhi Sultanate army, actually his entire army is completely wiped out now. Currently sitting on nine military to 57. That was not a good fight for him whatsoever. He was in such an immaculate position, but then it just went terribly. GG does get called game goes to our blue Jean Dark player Starflark. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed and I'll see you next time.